a strategist, a revolutionary, a provocateur. Steve Bannon helped create a movement intent on transforming the country. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Benjamin. But Bannon himself rarely talks publicly about the worldview at the heart of his politics. Uh, speaking uh, from Los Angeles today, right across the street from our, our headquarters in Los Angeles. One exception, this video at a Vatican conference less than three years before he entered the White House. He comes onto the screen, he's via Skype, it's a screeny video image, and he gives this speech where he talks about how Islam is a threat to Judeo-Christian civilization. I believe the world, and particularly the, the Judeo-Christian West, uh, is in a crisis. The threat that Bannon sees post 9-11 to the Judeo-Christian West is that radical Islamic theology uh, is metastasizing into more mainstream Islamic communities. We're at the very beginning stages of a very brutal and bloody conflict. We are in an outright war against jihadist Islam, Islamic fascism. And this war is, is I think, metastasizing almost qu far quicker than governments can, 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 uh, can, can handle it. Bannon describes himself as a combatant in what he believes is an epic war. Steve Bannon sees America's dilemma at this stage in its history as really part of a civilizational battle uh, between uh, the forces of the West and faith uh, and democracy versus that of Islam and terrorism. And he has uh, kind of reduced all of the conflicts of modern society to that essential face-off between the terrorists and the Americans. 